Yes, genetic engineering is used but it's like any other technology. It can be good and bad. One thing we did not do was create more hybrid seeds. What are people thinking? I am a Christian agnostic host, did John mean Gnostic? I do not believe faith alone is enough to get us back to God. I'm not sure what happens when we die but I'm pretty sure it's not a walk in the park. We are working on it host, space travel. What future technologies can we look forward to? I hesitate to answer but I'll give a bit. Hydrogen fuel cells and more efficient solar cells are big deals. Computer technology and software get much better. My greatest joy is sailing. For fun, I enjoy swimming, playing cards, reading, playing games on the net and talking with people who live in other countries. As a community, we celebrate much more and have bonfires and dances. My hobby is sorting through old magazines and videos of life before the war. After the war, early new communities gathered around the current universities. That's where the libraries were. I went to school at Fort Duff, which is now called the University of Florida. Not too much is different except the military is large part of people's life and we spend a great deal of time in the fields and farms at the university or fort. Most of my memories growing up are not fond. Life was very hard. Simple things make me happy like hugging my mother and father. Yes, we have cameras. More digital. Film is used like painting is today. No hologram camera though. Yes we have phones but the service is through the web. Most power generation is localized. It amazes me how much power is wasted now. Yes, solar is big. There is thought that a singularity generator could also be used but most people are against it. The elderly are highly revered and looked after on a community level. So are orphans. There is always something people can do no matter what. The idea of avoiding work is looked down on. Everyone pulls together to keep the community strong.